What's up, everyone? It's your two minutes in the box with Rod and Chris, the Puck Dogs from PickDogs.com. And Rod, we're taking a look at this Colorado Avalanche and Toronto Maple Leafs NHL matchup going down Saturday, January 8th, 2022. And uh, I'd say a, a very public and trendy uh, prediction for a Stanley Cup final preview here. Right? Maybe a little wishful thinking, too. <laughs> <laughs> I know, and we're a little biased. Yes, uh, we would, I would like to see the Leafs win one before I uh, finish my time here on Earth. But um, until then, in this one, uh, for me, I, I, I got to take the over in this one. How do you not take the over? Both teams, 7-2-1 and one to the over in their last 10 games. And these good offenses um, definitely can put the puck in the net. And Colorado leaving the way, as I said on the Puck and Crazy show yesterday. Um, Colorado, over. Colorado, Colorado's playing somebody, over. They're still leading the trends with the uh, most overs. I don't have that number right here, but it's craziness. Um, 20, 20, 20 the, and 7. Uh, yeah, exactly, to the over, right? It's just a crazy number uh, it is the abs this year. So, Colorado, over. It's almost on automatic. It's like, it's just like one of those things. You wake up, you brush your teeth, you do that stuff. It's just like, oh, Colorado's playing today? Yep. Go put the overbed in. <laughs> yeah, I think I can't disagree with you on that. I, I think the over's the player, but I, I'm also going to go with the Leafs. And call me a homer if you want, but Leafs won the first meeting this season 8-3, to three, and I think that that's... Yeah, there was there was no I believe there was no Nathan McKinnon and no uh, I believe it was Landis Cog I think was out for that one as well. But uh, either way, Toronto I think just a better team here. I, I I'm not sold on Colorado with with Darcy Quemper and Net and uh, you know I, I think this is just the Toronto got Jack Campbell. We're gonna see goals, but I think we're gonna see more goals from Toronto. And to to, to go further to that point, the over six one and one the last eight meetings and ten and zero in the last ten meetings in Colorado. I know these two teams don't play each other that often, but sometimes you just got to go where the numbers point you, and I think it's pointing us towards the over, and I think towards Toronto as well. But if you're looking for best bets from Rod, myself, our Puck Dogs package, or any of our other world-class handicappers, check out Pick Dogs Premium. Also click the link in the description below for our YouTube VIP package for more premium content. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and drop a like, and let's catch some winners.